Drama is a process in which we work together and use theatre to help us grow individually. The most valuable thing I've learned is probably how to work in front of other people. Because before, I always had a sense of, maybe I can make this line funny, or maybe I can do something different. But when I'm performing in front of my fellow drama majors, I feel much more comfortable and I can act the part more seriously and in character. Well, for the first part, we got a we got a list of different monologues we could choose. I think it was six. So you rehearse a monologue on your own, prepare it, and then you go the date they give you. It's audition day, so you go to the judges, you perform it to the judges, and then you have a little bit of a talk with them. So why you want to be in the drama program, for instance, and just similar questions to those. Our dance program, our students um, study the foundations and techniques of ballet and modern dance. As well, they are introduced and have the experience to work with guest choreographers and guest artists from different styles, such as jazz, world dance, hip hop, break dancing. My experience has been great. I have many supportive friends and teachers in my class. My experience here has been really good. I have bonded with um, a lot of people in my class and I'm really excited for the next few years here. We get very special opportunities to work with talented choreographers and teachers. It's so special because if it weren't for the teachers and the special guest choreographers we get time to time, I wouldn't be here and it's really great. Be confident, try your best, smile and point your feet. Have fun, try your hardest and be yourself. I'm Nazi Sakovars, the head of the Visual Arts Department in the Claude Watson Arts Program at Earl Haig. I'm also a graduate of this wonderful program. In our department, we're trying to really foster a sense of personal style for our students as well as a body of work, developing a body of work, but doing that through learning technical, traditional, theoretical, as well as conceptual approaches to art making. My audition process was exciting and fun. When I walked into the art room, at first sight it was big and there were windows everywhere. Everybody was sitting around these huge long tables that had fruit displayed in the middle. When everybody arrived, we started by drawing the fruit that was displayed on the table. We did some still life. One with contour, one with shading, and then one we used color. At first I did not know anyone, but I made friends quickly. It was fun because I ended up talking to the people I was sitting with. After the audition, I was called for the interview in which I showcased my art and answered some simple questions. But we were called in one by one to showcase our art. It was a little nerve-wracking because they did ask you questions, but I felt pretty good when I left there. And when I went home, I was, of course, worried that if I would get in, but I felt pretty confident of what I did there. And when I got a letter two weeks in the mail, I was really excited to have the opportunity to be in this school. Hello, my name 
My name is Dr. Sullivan. I teach at Claude Watson School of the Arts. My name is Tyler Simmons, and I'm a vocal major. Um, my name is Ineza, and I'm in vocal. Um, I'm Jocelyn, and I'm also in vocals. Um, my name is Sophia, and I'm a music major. Uh, I play flute, and I'm in grade 10. My name is Joanne, I'm a grade 10 music major and I play the flute. My name is Nisha, I'm in grade 10 and I'm a strings major. Claude Watts music program is a specialized music program for serious music students. They can study voice, strings, band, piano, and we also have a theory program that runs concurrently. Claude does challenge us. I think that they try and help us to get to a new level in our musical careers. They also challenge us to work on our time management and our responsibility, you know, handling academics and as well as our majors. It depends on the like the work that's assigned. Some of it's challenging, some of it's not as challenging, but I feel like as the year progresses it just gets more challenging. Yeah, definitely. Students who wish to come to Claude Watson apply for an audition. Right when you walk in, you feel really comfortable, you feel like you've known the teachers forever, and yeah, it's a really great experience to go through. You, you feel nervous, but like the moment you start talking to them, it feels like really, really free. Like, yeah. you know them for like a while. Yeah, like the, the, teachers really, really very, the teachers are very welcoming. I think the primary difference between the Claude Watson program and most high schools is that there's extra time given. We bring in plenty of visiting artists and coaches. We were able to accept students from right across the GTA, whereas many other schools uh, are restricted by the area in which they are located. Using creative thinking, student voice, and innovation in the film medium to tell stories, uncover truths, and explore controversies. So for the audition, we were given assorted pictures to put in a storyboard so we could tell a story. And this really helped us so we could show our talent in storytelling and show our creativity. By learning how to storyboard, edit and shoot, we all bonded to a point of being like a family. And I know it sounds really cliche and all, but Film Arch is my home away from home. Film Arch is breaking boundaries. Being organized. Problem solving. 